Kate dazzles at Commonwealth service as Duchess makes touching nod to Ukraine. Kate stunned royal watchers as she arrived at Westminster Abbey to attend the Commonwealth Day service. The Duchess of Cambridge donned a vibrant blue Catherine Walker dress coat paired with a matching hat, blue velvet heels and black gloves, which she decided to hold rather than wear. Her outfit immediately sparked a frenzy on social media, with many saying they were left stunned by the Duchess look. The royal blue of the Ukraine national flag was seen as a nod to those suffering in the Russian invasion. The Duchess also wore the same earrings and necklace seen back in 2020 when her and William met President Volodymyr Zelensky and his wife Alina. Kate stepped out alongside her husband Prince William and, upon arriving at Westminster Abbey, they were met with huge enthusiasm by bystanders, many of which could be heard cheering in support of the couple. Kate and William waved and smiled at members of the public and schoolchildren standing outside the abbey where they tied the knot almost 11 years ago. After stepping inside the abbey, the couple was spotted waiting for the Prince of Wales and Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall. Together, they then spoke with some of the ambassadors, senior politicians, and dignitaries lined up at the Abbey who came from across the UK and Commonwealth to celebrate the 54-strong union. Princess Alexandra, one of the 11 working royals and a close confidant of the Queen, was also in attendance. Her Majesty, on the other hand, was not present, as announced on Friday by Buckingham Palace. The statement read, after discussing the arrangements with the royal household, the Queen has asked the Prince of Wales to represent Her Majesty at the Commonwealth Service at Westminster Abbey on Monday. The Queen will continue with other planned engagements, including in-person audiences, in the week ahead. Last year the pandemic forced organisers to cancel the service for the first time in nearly half a century. Instead, the occasion was marked through a series of virtual events and members of the royal family appeared on a special BBC programme. This Commonwealth Day celebrates the global network of 54 independent countries who are innovating, connecting and transforming to help achieve shared goals like fighting climate change and boosting trade. As the Queen marks her Platinum Jubilee this year, Today's celebrations also featured a special focus on the role service plays in the lives of people and communities across the Commonwealth.